Hi Linda, hope you're well. Um, I'm just doing the video again because the first one didn't seem to work. I think it was too long. Um, but uh, yeah, just to give you a, um, a brief tour of each house and to give you an idea of how the road sits. That is the top of Isabel Lane up there. As you can see where that cream house is, that is where the village is. Um, so they were built in 2007 and 2016 for the later houses on the corner here. Um, so the first one on offer is Sapphire Cottage. I'll give you a brief walkthrough. So you've got the uh, parking to the right and then where those um, uh, the uprights are, that's where um, the and, um, gate finishes. So each house will have a nice oak porch. Um, as it says on, as it's explained on the illustration. So, you have open plan lounge. And open plan kitchen. Um, alarms on all the houses, um, spotlights, underfloor heating downstairs. Um, so this is the, um, the flooring in all the houses. It's a porcelain nose of tile, um, like a wood effect. Um, all your underfloor heating is used by this. All the kitchens are the same. Um, it's got the same fittings. As you can see, nice under lights too. Extractor, cooker, fridge and freezer. All Bosch appliances, very good quality. Good use of space. Dishwasher. Washer dryer. Got this lovely sink. It's cut into the worktop. Storage over here, which also acts as your cupboard for the boiler. I'll show you upstairs, I'll show you the ground floor toilet. Struck the fan, all these nice oak doors. So this is where your carpet would start. So you can, uh, you can choose your carpet if you get in there quick. Oak tops. There'll be an oak handrail all the way around the stairs. You've got a nice window in the landing, which is quite a good size to be fair. Um, just give you an idea of where that is. So you're not overlooked or anything really. You can pat you outside. Bedroom two. View, what do you think? So this is bedroom two. Bedroom one. Got a nice double doors, uh, double windows. Sockets either side of the of the bed. There's quite a decent space between that um, to allow for king size, etc. TV points. Two radiators in that one. Awesome nose of tiles, rainfall shower with extra handle. Just got a basin to go in there. It's a lovely vanity unit, it's quite big. Very lovely quality. I've got the, uh, he's gone for the best um, tradesman on this site, so everything is pretty much done how you'd want it if it was your house and you were having it done. That's how he wants people to feel. So the detail on the paintwork is superb. So right, so that's Sapphire House. I'll just show you the outside quickly. Each house um, has a little bit bigger garden. This is obviously Sapphire, so it's Sapphire Cottage. So it's at the top of the 
the road, which is probably the best thing about it um, compared to the others. Got nice outside lighting, taps, outdoor tap. Excuse the wall, it was painted and then it rained, so it's gonna be done again. So you've got storage, actually parking, fencing down here. So there's this feature wall. As you go down, the wall slowly disappears. It goes down. Each house has this storage, which is good. Portable tiles in the storage. Lighting, that's under the stairs. And then you'll have a gate here to go into your garden, a gate into next door. And that is the most of Sapphire Cottage. So I'll just give you, but even the brickwork is done to a very good standard. So, all these nice shrubberies are going in here, a bit of grass. And we've got the nice old fashioned lampposts on the street. All right, that's Sapphire Cottage. Cheers.